Yeah. There is a time for everything. There's a time to love. There's a time to settle down. There's a time to marry. When you think you are getting to that time, what do you do? You pray and have good friends. Make friends. This is what we've been sharing. The message must move down. Make friends, as many friends as possible. Have many friends, as many friends as possible. Serve in a local church. Be in a ministry group. So be friends. Have a lot of friends. It is always good to marry your friend. It's always good to settle down with your friend. So what do you do in your local church? Where do you spend your time the most? What do you love the most? Which people do you spend time with the most? Most likely, your partner is going to come out of such groups. Most likely, your partner will come from where you spend your time the most, the people you spend time with the most, your friends, your circle of friends. They are the people you know already. That is why you don't court for long, because you know them. We are not saying they are angels. You know them already. You have learned to relate with them as friends. So make as many friends as possible, especially from your local church. Serve in your local church. Be active. Participate. Be friendly to many people. If you're a lady, have as many friends as possible of the same sex. That means ladies and also of the opposite sex. But the closest of them should be of the same sex. So be actively involved in the things that are happening in the house of the Lord. And then as, when, you are, when, you, when you are ready, when you are ready, you will see in your prayer, in your preparation, God himself will begin to now indicate it to you. Hallelujah. But when you are not ready to marry, don't be, don't be proposing, don't be receiving proposal. When you are not ready to marry, focus on God, your, 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 your ministry, and your academics or your profession and wait and do what wait any other question